Welcome to Tea Time with Dorina. Hey, um, we're going to talk today about beauty is as beauty does. Some people say pretty is as pretty does. But how many know that beauty is skin deep? Yes, if we're going to say that somebody is beautiful, what beauty is as beauty does mean we um, judge that person according to their actions and not their appearance. You know, a lot of times people get caught up in appearance and they find out later on that they were tricked <laughs> because you know, beauty is as beauty does. How about that for tea time? Well, I'm glad that you joined me today. And um, I hope that the things that you and I been learning, that you've been putting them into practice. Because it does take practice to get better at anything that you do okay so we're growing in wisdom we got to learn how to practice wisdom practice discretion practice those things so that we can become real good at making right choices you know um there's a sometimes you know we have to use self-control well actually you know we should use self-control all the time but there's a three rule uh to self-control and is stop think and act so we stop before we do anything we think about it then we make the analysis and hopefully make the right choices and then act so part of beauty is as beauty does is us knowing how to act right because beauty really is skin deep and we should judge beauty based off of actions and not appearance okay because today oh my goodness yes we can dress it up and then you know later on when it's undressed we'll find out that it wasn't as beautiful as it was packaged you know what i'm saying <laughs> But you know, one thing will help us is that when you judge a person's actions, that will tell you who that person is. So don't get caught up in the, you know, don't judge me, don't judge me, because there's wisdom, there's wisdom in that. Now, we're not to judge people's motives because we don't know people's motives for doing things, but you can judge a person's character. You know, it's just like a fruit tree. Well, how are you gonna know which type of fruit it is unless you judge the leaves? By the leaves, a pear tree has different leaves than a peach tree. And if you know the difference you can judge what kind of fruit you're going to get and so that's the reason why uh there there are things that we should judge and there's things that we shouldn't we just need to know what we should and what we should that's simple okay so don't go by appearance just because you know somebody look good does not mean that they're a good person. So judge those actions, you know, more than likely if they act ugly, they are ugly, okay? Um, don't try to paint the picture 
to be prettier than what it is. Accept the picture for what it is so that you can make the right choices, okay? So we are talking about beauty is as beauty does. Put that principle into practice and that'll help you make less mistakes in your life as far as relationship wise. You know, friends, um, whether you want to be involved with somebody, you know, whether you want to marry somebody, you know, yes, judge that person's character so you will know what type of person that you're dealing with. And that is okay. Okay? <laughs> Tea time. Really, if you, you think know, about it, really, if a person acts a fool, more than likely, that's what they are. Now, I'm not talking about, you know, getting all, you know, irate because something happened. You know, I mean, still, you need to watch that, too. Because, you know, if people get all upset and fall apart and you know they want to fight you and stuff like that that's how that person is when they get angry and there's one thing that all of us have done or do especially as a young woman you know we think that we can change people but you know what? A person does not change unless they really want to. Don't fall for that lie or that mistake and think that, you know, you're going to change this person. Yeah, honey, you don't have that much power. And believe me, <laughs> since I've already been there, been there, done that, mm -mm, it doesn't work. Take, you know, the wisdom that is given to you and just know, you know, that, you know, you can't change people. People have got to want to change themselves. And, you know, talk to them. Talk to them. And, and throw some wisdom out there. And see whether or not they would receive it or not. That'll tell you right there whether or not that person is the type of person that uh, wants to learn, wants to improve their lives. You know, those are important things that you need to know about a person. You know, whether you're going to befriend them as friends or whether you want to go into a deeper relationship with that person as far as marriage or something like that. You know, a lot of people make a lot of mistakes, and especially women, thinking that they're going to change somebody. And they end up, you know, getting into a big mess. So really, you know, watch the person's character. Watch their behavior. It used to be uh, long ago that you know, a person could pretend, you know, three months. And then it got to six months. Now people are so good, they, mm, if you don't pay attention, a whole year could go by and you still won't know the truth about that person. If you don't pay attention and you don't watch and judge their uh, character, you know, you'll miss you'll miss the wisdom you'll miss the mark and you'll get yourself in a lot of trouble and really you know what i oh my goodness i done been there and i done done that and that's why i'm here today telling you mm, listen 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 to the wisdom that is given to you and another thing is you know, I really felt in my heart to say this, that, you know, sometimes we think that 
um, you know, older people, you know, they made that mistake. How can they say anything to me, you know, when they did the same thing? Well, honey, that's the reason why they can say the same thing to you because we have been through that already. And if you can get wisdom from some older person, listen to your mom, listen to your aunt, listen to some, your grandma, somebody that's older than you, that's giving you wisdom. Don't think that, you know, they can't tell you anything or you can't learn anything from them. Honey, we can learn something from a fool if it's nothing but to know how not to be one. You can still learn something from everyone around you. You know, just pay attention and look for, you know, look for that growth. Look for that, that wisdom. Look for that that better way of doing life. Look for it. Because really, if you don't look for it, it'll, it'll bypass you. And, you know, you know, but it takes us paying attention and keeping our eyes open and believing what we see. Beauty is as beauty does. Do not fool yourself into thinking that that one's not true, because it is. Tea time. So let's not make any more mistakes when it comes to judging people's character. It's okay to judge the character. It's not okay to judge people's motives because we don't know people's motives. But whether a person act right or act wrong, we can judge that. And, you know, yeah, some people just make wrong decisions, but still that tells you right there too that they may not know much or that you know, maybe they don't listen, um, or, you know, maybe they just don't know. I mean, you know, but you're not going to know all those things unless you pay attention. So pay attention to the people that are around you and watch out for that beauty is as beauty does. And don't let that principle slip and judge people based off of their character whether they're honest whether they have integrity whether they lie a lot you know whether they cheat people you know or you know you know check out you know you know i'll tell you something else to check out their family that'll help you know whether or not you know how they act with their family. That's what I'm saying. You know, you know, a lot of guys, if they don't treat their uh, sisters right or treat their mom right, they usually don't know how to treat a female right. That's wisdom. I'm not saying that's the case in every situation, but use it to find out. Don't wait until it's too late and then it's hard to get out of that thing so i want to uh, thank you for joining us today uh, don't forget what you have learned put it into practice and we will see you again next week all right marina is out